the street because everybody else is busy or they're not home. Yeah. But that one person on the street will be talking to the people that they meet on the street about, oh, you know, so and so came by the distance. Oh, wait, too bad you missed them. Yeah. And I think we're getting back to the old school, yeah. like your parents, back in the old days where people want to see, want to look you in the eyes, they want to hear your voice, they want to, they want to make their own judgments. And I, I really think, despite everything that people are saying about how technology is, is, is disengaging people mm -hmm. from each other and it's taking, I, I think what it's doing is personalizing. Yeah, you're 100% right. And, and, and you know, and I, I, I totally uh, understand and appreciate the, the, the social media's impact. It is huge and it's extremely important. Um, but I don't think, uh, but it has to be coupled with a, a good, you know, meet Joe Chimino campaign. Yeah. And that's why, we, you know, I go to numerous meet, uh, public events daily, if not, you know, several. You can watch, see my Facebook page. Uh, and going door to door and going to events and going to senior groups. Um, door, door to door isn't like I, you know, you go to the door and the first thing is, oh my, you know, yesterday in the West End, a couple of people, oh, don't you mean, oh, let me come out, you know, so they come out and on the front stoop and, and talking. Uh, yeah, one couple, uh, yeah, English as second language or Italian, I was able to speak to them in Italian and, and uh, talk, to so them, much so, right? talk to them about my platform. Yeah. yeah. So it's, it, and you know, I enjoy it. Whether they vote or not, it just meant so much to them. Yeah, and, and they're going to talk to people who are going to yeah. run. <laughs> and I enjoy it. Like I, and I enjoy going uh, well, you better, there. I, I, I so, you're spending a lot of time out there. Not, I, don't, I don't sit there. So, you know, people keep saying, oh, I'm going to come in the office and see you. Well, you better give me time because I'm, I'm usually I'm there at 9 in the morning or 8.30 in the morning, and I'm not there till 10 o'clock at night. So. Yeah. And I really appreciate you taking time to come in uh, and, and spend you know, the 30 or 40 minutes here. Um, did we miss anything that you want to? No, you know, thank you very much. Like, thank you for oh, the invitation. This, this is uh, this is wonderful, and it, at least it allows me the ability to, to, to speak to speak yeah. to to the folks and and uh, have have my uh, my truth forward and and and, uh, yeah. and my sincerity. And I think uh, you know people people as they get to know me know I'm I'm, I'm here for them, and uh, I have a sincere desire if if given the privilege to represent this writing, I'm 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 there to to improve our community. Perfect, and people will be able to see this. Uh, through your Facebook, through your website, if they want, they can link to it because it's going to be uploaded this afternoon or tomorrow. Okay. So, uh, um, again, another opportunity for people to meet Joe Chimino. Awesome. Um, I want to thank everyone for listening to the Learning Clinic on CKLU 96.7 FM. My uh, guest this afternoon has been Joe Chimino, running for the Ontario NDP party in the Sudbury riding. And Joe, good luck uh, with the rest of the campaign. Thank you very much. It comes fast. It is. Uh, <laughs> and, and, sleep, uh, comes, sleep comes on the 13th. That's right, on the 13th. Use for a couple hours. So again, thank you for being here and uh, thank you for listening to us.